Admiral, um, good to be back out there and getting some winners today. How, how pleasing was that? No, it was a good run out. I think it's been about a month, maybe five weeks since I sort of last played. Been recovering from the hamstring injury, which I picked up just before the Blackburn game. Been doing my work with the rehab team, sports science team. I'm happy to be out there. So that was before the literally before kickoff, wasn't it? I think the Blackburn. Yeah. Game. Was that just something that went in the warm up kind of thing? So in the warm up, literally towards the back end of the warm up, sort of felt a little tweak. I knew something wasn't right. So I tried to test it out the last little parts of the warm up, and I knew playing would probably be make it even worse. So we made a decision to sort of take me out of that game. And I think maybe if I had played, I'd have probably been out a little bit longer than I have been. It must have been doubly frustrating because you were actually starting that game as well, weren't you? So mm -hmm. to, to, to come out like you did was, was must be annoying. Yeah, I guess sort of every player wants to play every game. And then to have to pull out because of something physical is obviously disappointing. But at the same time, it's a long season, still loads of games to play. So I was just looking to get myself back into contention and hopefully help the team pick up points and pick up wins. I guess the hamstrings is quite tough, so you, you can't really go push it too quickly, can you, in case it no. goes and you're out for longer? Yeah, so with the sports science team and the sort of the SNC team, we sort of had measures and marks that we needed to hit. And we sort of made sure that each step was done correctly and we followed each step. And until we sort of completed stage one, we didn't move on to stage two. So it's been a methodical process and we got through it all sweet. And it's not just been you, is it? There's been a lot of injuries mm. for this they've been you've kind of been hit by it in the yes. I think, couple months of the season. I think we haven't really had a full strength squad, but the guys who have been fit have clearly done the job to take us to where we are now. But I think as more people get back fit and we sort of have more competition for places, we'll only excel. And out there today, I mean, you've got 60 minutes. How did you feel it went? No, it was a good 60 minutes, good run around, sort of just cobwebs off a little bit, sort of get some match minutes, build up my match fitness. And that's all we can really ask for in these games. Playing in the striker's role as well. I mean, you got, got well, sort of, as, the, as the first half wore on, you became more involved in more of a goal threat as well. Mm -hmm. You scored as well. So yeah. nice to get nice back on the on target. Yeah, of course. As a forward, you're always looking to score every time you're on the pitch. So I'm happy to contribute with a goal. Some, some good players out there. Obviously, Alan Campbell was back, and a lot of you were getting some minutes today. So, mm -hmm. Chris, the squad is hopefully getting in a bit better place now as well. Yeah, I think a few of the boys who haven't played as much in the rec in the past weeks and sort of over the international break, everyone sort of had a rest. The ones that needed a few minutes got the minutes they needed in today, and everyone sort of gave it a good go. And you can see that on the, with the performance that we all put in for the 60 minutes. Have you been seeing how the, how the clubs got on as well in the matches since you've been? <laughs> yeah, of course. Every game, every home game I've been to, haven't been to away games like Bournemouth away, but every home game tried to watch. I've watched every home game, even the away games, tried to find streams to watch the matches. And obviously the video analysis, post games, pre games, been always involved. So I'm always sort of been in and around it and involved with everything that's going on. There were some good games, obviously the commentary on the home. There's been some great performances yeah. to, mm -hmm. that, the, that the club have put together despite the absences of a number of players. Yeah, I think Bristol City away. I think if you look at it sort of from a statistical point of view, we probably on another day we walk away 3-4-1 one win and then obviously Coventry 5-0 no win and they were flying at the time which 5-0 no win at any level is obviously a great achievement and I think there's a few games which we've drawn which we maybe could have won I think Swansea 3-0 up end up drawing 3-3 three, three. but I think sort of them things will come our way and we'll get the rubber degree and then them games will be picking up three points instead of one point. And the team's still in quite a good position despite the people being missing mm -hmm. I mean they're still I think 12th at the moment or something like that yeah. and in good position to push on. Yeah, exactly. So considering all the sort of upsets that we had, I think sort of being mid-table is sort of a good platform for us to kick on now and hopefully we can climb up the table. Okay, so I guess you hope you know more injuries, you can actually really push on and, and, and have a sustained run in the first team if possible. Yeah, that's the plan. So that's the, that's the end of the injury. So now it's time to get my head down, work hard and then see what I can do to help the team. Millwall away this weekend now and then another away game at Derby. Yeah. It's too, too, too tough away trips, isn't it really? Yeah, I think starting with Millwall away, which will be tough. We sort of already know about their physicality and sort of what they're going to bring. And we're preparing to sort of counteract that and how we're going to impose our game on them. So we sort of deal with that game on Saturday. And then after that, we'll move on to the derby game. I suppose to look at a game like this today, hope yourself get, get included in, in, in the match mm -hmm. squad for the weekend if possible. Yeah, that'll be a decision up to the gaffer and sort of the other staff, whether I'm ready or not. But I feel ready, so we'll just see what happens.